Martin Truex Jr. brings out the first caution as he spins coming off turn number four. And we have heard drivers that have mentioned loose. Martin Truex Jr. pushing the limit just a little bit too much. Just backed it down up there. You heard him say, I just backed it down up there. Keep talking about how slick this racetrack is and how hard you have to push. See what happens right here. He already gets loose. Yeah. Almost like the air around that lap car might have affected him just a little bit. So now he's up out of the groove. Oh, the car's man. moving around a lot. The car just steps around there's on a, him. There's a bump right over the tunnel there, Jeff, in three and four. And it looked like the car just hopping a little bit. So clearly he was, you know, we heard Brad Keselowski say I'm building loose the longer he ran the looser he got you'd have to wonder if that's not what was happening with Truex see he stays in the gas trying to keep from making contact with the wall just brushes it you guys mentioned the bump the left rear tire you can watch it go over the bump I can't tell if it's before or after he spins out right oh right there yep. you saw the back of the car hop Probably already loose, right, Junior? Then the back goes over the bump, and now already a little loose turns into really loose. Yeah, and it's, I think, Steve, don't you believe that the way they have to get the back of these cars down to be able to take advantage of the downforce the undercarriage creates, they have these cars pretty stiff spring-wise in the back. Absolutely, especially between the flat and the banked end of the racetrack. You can't have a lot of movement.